Hello, welcome back to my channel. So I have some sister wives tea for you guys. So Janelle Brown's son, Garrison, he has bought a $329,000 Arizona home featuring a courtyard and a fireplace amid his feud with his father, Cody. So in the last episode of Sister Wives, we saw Janelle and Cody, they had a huge argument. And Janelle told Cody their son was trying to save up enough money for a new home, but didn't have enough money to move out yet. So over Thanksgiving, Cody threatened to evict his sons Gabriel and Garrison from their home. And Cody, he set these really strict COVID guidelines for his families that they have to abide by in order for them to get together for the holidays. Like, yes, he's going and following stuff like the CDC saying like, wash your hands, wear masks, use hand sanitizer. But he's also kind of taking things to extreme level. Like you have to change your clothes as soon as you get back in the house from going anywhere anywhere and you have to wipe down all the mail and everything and Janelle's sons they have girlfriends they have lives of their own they have jobs and Janelle there's just no way possible with her young sons for them all to stay home so Cody was like well the only way I'm going to be able to come around the family if you guys aren't willing to stay home all the time is if you kick out your sons and Janelle she said she's not willing to do that she said it's a different time in a different age, she said, you don't kick your kids out of the house at 18 and say, hope you do good. I'm done. I tried. And, you know, Cody thinks it's so easy because when he was 18 years old, his dad kicked him out of the house with a junker car and $50 and said, hey, figure it out. But despite all the drama going on in the family, Garrison decided to take matters into his own hands and decided to flee the nest and get a place of his own. So Garrison bought a $329,000 Arizona home as a courtyard, a fireplace. It's super nice. It was revealed that he has $336,000 loan that he took out to purchase his new Arizona home. And Garrison is only 23 years old, so he's doing big things for a 23-year-old. And he agreed to have his debt paid back to the lender in full by January of 2052. So it sounds like he has like a 30, 31-year home loan. And Garrison still lives pretty close to the family. He only lives 10 minutes away from his dad, Cody's $890,000 home. So Garrison's house is two stories, four bedrooms, and two bathrooms. It's modestly spacious and it includes a lot of natural light. He has new hardwood flooring and it's 1,441 square foot space and it includes a fireplace on the ground floor. He also has a small fenced in courtyard and backyard. So I was curious. I was like, what is her son doing for a living to afford a nice house like this? I cannot find what his current job is. He was enlisted in the Nevada Army National Guard on November 19th of 2015. He had went wanted to join the Army but made a compromise with his dad Cody to join the National Guard instead. So Garrison followed his mom Janelle Brown when the family moved from Las Vegas, Nevada to Flagstaff, Arizona where he got a job. And it's unclear what his current job is but he's passionate about carpentry and helped renovate a camper van for his mom when she moved onto the Coyote Pass property temporarily this past summer. I'm sorry, guys, if you heard my cat. My cat is super loud. But Garrison also owned his own business. Back in 2019, he started a Hawaiian shirt business. And the shirts that he's wearing here with his brother and his dad, Cody, these are some of his shirts that his business produced. He called it Bob's Flora, which is currently on hiatus. And Robert is actually Garrison's first name. And the website that states that his brand has plans to return when it can find a way to manufacture the shirts domestically in the United States but we know that's going to be a lot more expensive. But then he can say, hey, this is all American made and we're sitting here helping out the United States economy by employing people in the United States and doing business here. So we'll just have to stay tuned and see if his business comes back. But I'm super happy that Garrison finally got his own place and his mom was, you know, on his side and being understanding, unlike his dad, Cody, so he could afford a nice place like this. So congratulations to Garrison. And that's it for this video guys let me know your thoughts in the comments below make sure you give this video a thumbs up subscribe and thank you so much for watching